Hey, good morning, everybody. It's Randy with my cup of Primo Java. You know, that's pretty good stuff. Hey, listen, this morning, it's one of those wherever the heck I'm at videos, but I'm in the tan room. Yeah, this is my office. As you can see, I've been pretty busy hanging pictures on the wall. <laughs> hey, listen, guys, someday, somewhere, somehow, there will be a picture back there, I promise you. Not that you really care, but there will be. Listen, this morning I want to talk to you about something that might be of interest to you. You know, we have this wonderful product called Trim Up. Now, as of this morning, I'm down 29 pounds on this product. And people have said to me all the time, Randy, I don't understand this. How is it that you're losing so much weight? Well, it's about, uh, I haven't kept track of the days now, it's about 55 days, 56 days, something like that. So... Basically, what this boils down to is I'm losing an average of about a half a pound a day. So it's not that I'm losing massive amounts of weight in a short period of time, but I'm losing weight over time, okay? And I think that that's one of the things that you have to think about when you're using a product like this. Now, the other thing you have to think about when you're using a product like this is what does this product actually do for you? What's causing this product in your body to help your body lose weight? Well, there's two basic things that it does for you uh, that are probably doing the most for helping you lose weight. One of the things is this product contains something called the stack. Now, the stack is made up of the, uh, the guarana, the white willow, and the, um, the um, citrum, the, um, um, oh goodness gracious, the, the uh, Seville orange extract. It took me a long time to spit that out. Basically, those are three things. The guarana provides a source of caffeine. Now, of course, we know your body's got to convert the guarana, the guaranine into caffeine. And then the, uh, the orange extract, bitter orange extract, provides something called synephrine. And then the white willow is kind of like acid. It's a natural aspirin is what it is. Those three together are something called the stack. And what they do is they tell a certain kind of fat in your body called, we call it bat fat, which stands for brown adipose tissue. And what it does is it starts that brown adipose tissue to activating. You see, when you're younger, you have more of that than you do when you get older. It's the brown fat that tells your body to burn the white fat, which is the bad fat. So this activates that, and it increases your base metabolic rate just a little bit. In other words, the rate at which your body, let's just, an easy way to explain it, imagine an engine in your car when you started, it's at idle. If you were to step on the gas a little bit, it just goes a little bit faster. The engine runs just a little bit faster. And that's what this does. When we say it increases your base metabolic rate, it causes your engine to run just a little bit faster, telling your body, I need more fuel. Because to run faster, you've got to have more fuel. So the body goes to the food source that it has on hand, which is that white fat. And it starts to burn that fat. Now, if you're a woman, you're going to want to measure yourself. Because women have less muscle tissue or muscle mass than men do. And the more muscle mass you have, the faster you lose weight. Because your body has to keep all that muscle nourished. But in women, their fat reserves are, are larger than a men's fat reserves per body size or per man or compared to a man to a woman. And the reason for that is, by the way, it's part of our, um, uh, it, was, it was God put that into us, into women, because women are the ones that, that perpetuate the race. So you have to have body fat for fuel when you're pregnant to make sure that you feed, the, that the baby has plenty of energy and plenty of nutrients and your fat stores those nutrients. So, at any rate, but you've got to measure yourself because you will lose fat at the same rate that a man loses fat, except that you have less muscle uh, tissue on your body, so it won't go quite as, you know, the speed. In other words, if a man loses a pound in a, couple, in, in a day, you might lose a half a pound in a day or less. Maybe it takes you two days to lose a pound because you just don't have the muscle mass that a man does, okay? However, a pound of fat and a pound of muscle are still a pound, right? Except that if, if this represented, hang on here, <clears throat> let me get something here, little container, uh, if, well that's not even a good container, 
Well, let's say that my thumb represented a pound of muscle. This bottle would represent a pound of fat. In other words, they both weigh the same, but the fat takes up more space because it, it's lighter in mass. It's not as dense as the muscle is, so it, it doesn't uh, take up as much space. So women will oftentimes, as their body burns more of this fat, they'll lose this fat and they'll lose inches, but they haven't lost as much weight because the fat... In, in drinking inside, maybe hasn't burned up as much weight-wise, but it's burning getting rid of the fat. So it should always kind of go by what your clothes feel like. Secondly, here's something else that happens, and this happens a lot to you women. I'm not picking on you today, but it's the honest to God truth. When you start on a diet program, you know what happens when you get on stuff like this? Something goes goofy up here, and what I, here's what I mean by that is, you all of a sudden have this thing in your head that, uh-oh, now I've got to go on a diet. I've got to watch everything I eat so I don't eat too much. And if you're used to eating more food and you all of a sudden step back and say, uh oh, I can't eat this, I can't eat that, I can't do that, blah, 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 pretty soon your body gets, isn't getting the amount of food that it used to. And you know what happens when, when a body doesn't get the amount of food that it's used to, especially if it happens quickly? It goes into something called starvation mode. When your body goes into starvation mode, it takes every calorie that comes into it and it says to itself, holy smokes, holy smokes, there's not enough food. We've got to conserve all of the food that we take in because this could be a long dry spell. And so what it does is starts to take every calorie that you take in to the best of its ability and store it because it thinks that there's no more food coming. So that's why when you go on a product like this, especially women, now men are different, remember, Men have two things going for them that women don't in this situation. We have a much larger body mass which causes our body to burn fat quicker. Also, the sheer act of moving that body mass is more energy burnt, calorie, um, uh, calorie heat burnt per hour than a woman would be. So we burn it faster. It's just that simple. And because of our body size, we can get away with eating a little bit more food than women can. But, Here's the secret. Don't start starving yourself because you started on this product. I had, I've had two women call me and say, Randy, I don't understand this. I'm taking this product. I'm not losing any weight. And then I'll say, tell me what you're eating. And they say, oh boy, I just I get up in the morning and I have a just a really small piece of fruit for breakfast. Well, first of all, a piece of fruit for breakfast is the wrong thing to have because what that's doing is putting sugars into your system. What you ought to have is have something with protein in it for breakfast, not fruit. Okay? Uh, but at any rate, I'm having a small piece of fruit, and then I'm not having, I used to have a snack, and I'm not having that anymore. I'm having a salad for lunch, and then uh, I'm eating maybe a small little, some crackers or something, or I'm eating some celery sticks and some carrots, and then at supper, it's a really small meal. Well, it's no wonder you're not losing any whack. In fact, you're putting your body into starvation. Now, now eventually, if you stay doing that, you're, if your body's taking in less calories. If you're putting out more energy and you're taking in less calories, that's the secret to losing weight calories expended versus calories taken in. But even in even though that's the case in starvation mode, your body won't do that. Not for a little while. So if you're going to continue to be that way, then continue it. Don't stop doing it. Okay? Don't give up and say, hey, this ain't working for me. Here's what I'm going to suggest to you. Eat less calories than you did before, but don't start out and saying, I'm going to eat my diet was 1,500 calories. I'm dropping down to uh, 1,000 or 800 or 900 calories today. This is what I'm going to do. Bam, 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 bam. No, 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 no. Don't do that. If you're at 1,500 calories and that's what you're consuming in a day, drop it down. Instead of dropping it to 1,000 calories, drop it down to 1,300 calories. Just take 200 calories off. It's less calories than you took in. Eventually, your body will burn it. And then eat in many little small meals during the day. Don't, oh, 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 I'm trying to tell you is to continue to eat. If you don't eat, you're not going to lose weight. But shift your eating in one area. If you're eating a lot of carbohydrates, cut those down. Stick with, if you're going to eat carbohydrates, complex carbohydrates, which are things like fat, I mean like uh, 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 vegetables, in fact, as close to the raw state as you can get them. But vegetables are complex carbohydrates. In other words, they are carbs, but they contain a lot of fiber, which stops your body from using those carbs as readily. 
And then also, they're the kind of carbs that your body has to fight to break down to get them. It's an easy way to explain it. They're complex carbohydrates. If you take in a bowl of ice cream, that's almost pure sugar, baby. That goes into your system right away. And guess what your body does with anything that it gets too much of? Think about this for a minute. Anything that it gets too much of, your body converts to fat. It's the most amazing fat conversion machine that was ever invented. Just a minute. i got to have another shot of my Primo Java. So, kind of cut down on those. Stick with more complex carbohydrates, protein, and guess what? Fat! Did you know that when your body takes in fat, it burns fat? It's a misnomer out there that if you eat fat, you're going to get fat. Your body doesn't get fat by eating fat. Now, if that's all you consumed, of course it would. But the normal amount of fat that you would eat in a day, what's fat? Healthy fats, like like if you're going to eat something with uh, with a... It's don't use margarine, use real butter. Uh, eat uh, avocados, they are a very healthy fat. Olive oil is a healthy fat. When you're eating a piece of meat, you don't have to trim all of the fat off of it, leave some of it on. That fat doesn't hurt you, okay? If you're eating a steak every day and it's loaded with fat, of course it is. But do you eat steaks every day? Of course you don't. When you're eating the chicken, Leave a little bit of the skin on it if you don't want. Don't tear all the skin off. The skin contains fat. And it's actually not bad for you. So, the point is this. Don't stop eating and starving yourself because this ain't going to work as well. This requires, by the way, uh, energy to be coming into your body to work. It requires water. Water. Guess what we drink? Guess what we drink a lot of? Water good water with this in it and with this in it guys and gals we've got the secret you just got to use it now let me tell you something else about this that's extremely important this is not a lose weight drop pounds fast get on this massive quick diet we're not uh, going to tell you that you're going to lose 13 pounds in 13 days or whatever those diet things say on TV this is a product that is designed to take to get your body into weight loss, um, to, to help your, and support your body in normal weight loss, and it's designed to do that. But you've got to keep using it. I guarantee you that if you will just continue to use this, don't try to starve yourself to death. Continue to eat food, but eat healthier food if you can. But I mean, listen, yesterday I was out and had... Uh, uh, some rice, it, it was uh, uh, um, a um, Cajun rice with some spices and stuff on it, had gravy on it. And you know something, I even had a little bowl of ice cream when I was done. But I don't do that every day. I had that as a little treat for myself yesterday. I got up this morning and I'd still lost a half a pound. Okay, so continue to put food into your body. Continue to make sure you're drinking plenty of water. And I'm going to give you another little secret that's going to be a big help to you. When you get up in the morning before you do anything else, make sure that you pour yourself at least 10 ounces of our water with the minerals in it, with the aqualite in it, and with the ionite in it, and drink that 8 to 10 ounce glass of water first thing in the morning. Before you do anything else, before you have coffee, before you have breakfast, before you have anything, drink that glass of water. Also, before you eat any meal, I don't care if it's a small little meal, if you're eating six meals a day that are smaller or three larger meals, it doesn't make any difference. Drink a full glass of water before you eat. Water hydrates you. Oftentimes we eat because we think we're hungry and we're really thirsty. And the older you get, the less, the less that signal of thirst seems to affect you. Now I know this is getting to be a little bit long, but I want you to understand that this product works. Now, if you combine this product, and I don't have the canister here, but you combine this product with this product. See, I take one of these in the morning when I get up with my glass of water. I take one of them before lunch, and sometimes I forget because I get so busy and, and I'm talking to people, and it's way past lunchtime, and I don't take this. I forget it, but I always take one in the morning. And then I drink one of these around 2 o'clock in the afternoon. 
I have a canister, but I don't have that right here. But I drink one of those at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. And I'm losing weight. But I'm also doing this. I'm eating. I'm not starving myself to death. I've cut my calories a little bit, but you know how I cut them? Only about 200 calories. Now, as time goes on, I cut another 200 calories off from what my body is used to, and it's called a step-down formula. Instead of dropping from here to here, I'm going from here to here to here to here. Get my body used to the less calorie intake so it doesn't go into starvation mode. Guys and gals, this is a winner. Can I tell you something else about this that's absolutely astounding? I have people that don't need to lose one ounce of weight that are taking this product. And you know why? Because they're feeling better and they have more energy and they're accomplishing more in life because this product gives you a lot of energy besides energy in a capsule. It's unbelievable. So, what I'd like to do is share with you today the opportunity to make a lot of money. And that is carry this bottle with you wherever you go. Carry it with you. Now, we don't have sample packs of this product and never take capsules out of this bottle and put into a baggie and send them to somebody that you don't know. Now, if it's a good friend of yours and they live a long ways away and you say, look, I'd like you to try something. And for some reason, now what I do is I just say, hey, look, guys, you need to try this. Um, <clears throat> what you need to do is we'll need get you, we need to order you some of this right away. And I try to get them to order a bottle. But if that's absolutely impossible, just cannot be done, then I, I will put some of these capsules into a little baggie and send to them because I know them. I know them extremely well. There's no question in my mind that when I send it to them, they're going to take it or they're going to say, oh my God, what's in that? I do send information along with it, by the way, showing all the ingredients. Excuse me, I've got to sneeze and I'm holding it back. Um, but carry this with you and if you're with somebody, take it out and set it on the table. When you sit down at a restaurant to meet somebody, set this on the table. What does this say? Trim up. Reveal the new you. Dietary supplement. What does that tell you? Ah, lose weight, lose weight, lose weight. Oh, wow. <laughs> Sorry. I flip out once in a while. If you set this on the table, you're going to get people asking about it. If you get people asking about it, they're going to want to know more about it. When they want to know more about it, guess what? They want to buy some of it. And you can even open the bottle right here and say, hey, Look at this, and here's what you do. You, you take and you <clears throat> take one or two of these capsules, however you want to do it. You know what I do with most people? I give them two. And you say, but Randy, that might be too much. I don't care. I hope that they just get jittery and everything from it. Because I want them to know it works. And if they tell me, wow, that was really cool, I loved it, then they want more. If they say, oh man, whew, I just got the shakes and everything from it. Well, some people, most people can take two. Some people can't. You're obviously one of those, so you just take one. You want to try one again? Call marketing, folks. Use the noggin. Start showing this. Why do you suppose we spend money? And why do you suppose our graphic artist does all of this? What do you suppose they does? Why didn't it just have a plain old bottle with a black and white word that says trim up? Look at this. This says lose weight. This says lose weight, lose weight, lose weight. Okay. <sighs> I don't know what else to say. I'm out of words. Except this. Wherever you go, it might be a slimmer you going there, but wherever you go, remember these words. Always make the most of it because, well, first of all, wherever you go, there you are, right? And always make the most of it because nobody in the world is going to do it for you. God bless you. I hope that you're taking trim up. I hope you're drinking vibrant. And by golly, you better be drinking our water. Have a blessed day. We'll see you later with the next Wherever I'm At video.